Welcome, 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 welcome. All right, listen, I'm going to do my earth signs now. All right, so Capricorn, Taurus, Virgos. Okay, we're just going to see what's brewing. All right, let's see what's what's coming our way. All right, I just did water, and uh, now I'm going to do earth. All right, my Capis, my Virgos, my Tavidians. Yep, my Tavidians, that's what I call you, because that's what you are. Roses in my garden. So let's see what's brewing within the next week, okay? Um, let's see what's brewing. Roses in my garden. What are two of wands? All right. What are ten of swords? I'm not reading these ones reversed. All right, but. To me, it's like, are you going to keep allowing yourself to be stabbed over and over and over? Holy shit. Too many. What? 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 I don't want all these. <sighs> Friggle sticks. Dang it. This one wants to be near this one, so that's where it's staying. I saw this one first. And then I saw that. No, I saw that one. Then that one. Then this one. Way too many. Two of Wands. It's all about making a decision. What direction are we going in? All right. Um. To me, I feel like are we going towards work? All right, because you you've been stabbed in the back. We got the Ten of Pence. All right. Um. Then we have the Star. And then we have the Three of Pence with the Ten of Wands, with the Page of Pence, all right? So to me, this is definitely work related to, even though I'm a love channel, so I'm not really gonna go there with work, but because I see it, I'm gonna call it real quick, okay? I feel like some of you have a choice to make when it comes to a new work endeavor, all right? And I think you're like, you had enough with the whole people talking, garbage at work or whatever you being taken advantage of or something happening at work so you're like screw this i'm out you're gonna take a new opportunity um with something else when it comes to work because it's just there's too much going on at work and you're like i'm done all right you, you have to make a, a new opportunity um because it's there's too much weight i will tell you be careful with signing contracts with somebody right now with a new business opportunity, okay? Um, make sure you leave this new job, you old job, if that's the case, make sure you leave it properly, okay? Two weeks, three weeks, whatever, whatever you choose, but just do it the right way. Do it, do it the right way, okay? So besides that, let's move on to love, all right? So Capricorn, Taurus, Virgos. All right. I, I, you feel, I feel like you have a decision to make when it comes to a new outlook with somebody that probably wants to work together with you. I feel like this person may have stabbed you in the back, but now is seeking stability and everything went down the way it was supposed to go down. Could there have been a third party and somebody had to lay some weight down? Yeah. To have a new opportunity. Yeah. All right. Um, I can also look at it like you're choosing a new direction because you try to work with somebody and this person stabbed you in the back because of a third party and it was your stability, but you were carrying a lot of weight and finally you let that go to take a new opportunity. But I feel like this, here's the deal though. I feel like this opportunity has already been presented to you. I feel like your past is coming back around, but not the past that you just had a different past. And I say that because the way the page is coming in, looking at everything, it's like decision, decision. And laying down a lot of weight in between. And right in the middle is, is to me, this isn't even healing. This is a destined thing for me. All right. A lot of with all my zodiacs and elements right now are going through um, some major changes, which is beautiful. Beautiful. I love energy shifts like that. Okay. I really do. Um, so this is what's brewing. If you, if you haven't seen this coming yet, um, this could be a new opportunity with somebody else. But for me, I'm feeling the past. I'm feeling like somebody's going to lay some weight down and come back around or vice versa. All right. Um, tell me about those two of wands. The 
emperor. You, you, to me, I feel like, like I said, you, you just got out of something and you, you're taking control over your life again. All right. Yeah. Making big boy, big girl decisions. All right. You stepped your game up. I'm wrong. This is the Hierophant. I feel like he's staring at the three, though. I feel like, I know this is going to sound weird, guys, but to me, this is work-related. Some of you are leaving jobs and starting a spiritual thing. It's more than just a spiritual path, guys. Like, you're like, you're laying some shit down in your life. I mean, you let go of some comic shit and you let go and work. I mean, this is huge. What is, I don't know why this Hierophant is staring at the three and saying, like, take this new opportunity. So, what does the Hierophant want? This isn't like love. This isn't commitment to me, guys. This is, yeah, this is coming out of confusion. You've been, I think you've been spiritually confused. No offense. All right, moving on. Tell me about the Eight of Pence. Um, you're not using your intuition. So it's like you weren't using your intuition when it comes to this new style. It was like a denial thing. This is a spiritual read, guys. More than love, I'm sorry. But it's still important, obviously, okay? Because that's what's going on with my earth elements. I mean, clearly, I, I'm talking, look at all the pens on the board. You're writing your stinking element. And it's not a stinking element. I love that element. But two of my elements are in there. Scorp and Taurus. I mean, not Scorp, um, Caps. Cap and Taurus. To me, this is secrets could have came out too, and that's why you're now at your crossroads, okay? Because of the backstabbing in the third party, this person could have now that that's the hierophant staring at the three. This person could have been married. I don't know why I didn't see that. This person was already committed. This person already had options. You were not the only person in that relationship. Tell me about the. Twinsies, two of them. I was going to say clarify, you know, the ah, mother, the high priestess, all right? And it's like, I got you coming out of talk Sunday with a brand new stat. Well, my, my cappies just got themselves out of a very toxic um, link between a comic. So psh, good for you because that's how that just went because you were stabbed in the back. We'll take a new opportunity, which makes complete sense. That's why you're at your two. A pence, all right? Because it's like, here comes a new opportunity. So now we're going to decide what direction, where are we going to go? But I need you to ground yourselves. I don't feel like you're grounded. Um, you've been stabbed in the back. I don't even need to clarify that because you left that. You left that. You did. I know you did. Tell me about the ten of pence. This is what you're going towards. All right? The moon and the empress reverse. So that was reversed. All right. So that's what you left. All right? At one point, this was stable. And it's no longer stable. And I believe secrets came out. So you are out. All right. This went down the way it was supposed to go down. I don't know if you were having an affair with somebody at work. Or if this person was dealing with somebody at work. All right. There was definitely three people in this this scenario right here. There's no, no question. All right. The person you were seeing was seeing somebody else. And in either a marriage or a commitment. And I will tell you, I really feel like it was work related. But now destiny stepped in and, and that's done. All right. That's the end of that. We wrap that up. Tell me about, tell me about that. All right. Because you're taking your new style. All right. The lovers. See, there was still somebody else. All right. So now you got your queen of pence. So now I think for, in this case, you're going towards your twin. All right. Because the queen of pence and making an offer. But what kind of offer is it? Because that fish is sticking halfway out of the cup. So it's like, 
how we feel like we're daydreaming. I, I feel like you're still unsure. It's still a fishy scenario. And I think it has to do with that. And I never read my fishes ever in their cups. All right, you had choices, and now this is like water. It was destined right next to the lover. They were next to right next to each other with the queen of pence. All right, it's like the it's like the same thing. So you might be dealing with water. All right, damn, holy sim similar. Um, you're laying the weight down though. Tell me about the ten. You wanna you wanna go in and make an offer, or somebody's gonna come and make an offer to you. All right, the queen of swords reverse. You're dealing. There's somebody who does a big B right now and, and, and cut and, and somebody cut something out of the situation and, or vice versa. There's no question. It looks like you got two offers coming in now. I, I feel like you may have cut off a certain offer now that you're reevaluating. Did you just try to eat my earring? Um, definitely a third party. All right. When it comes to this. So. We're back to the same scenario. I don't know if this person is going to apologize or if you're going to come in. I feel like you're going to come in and apologize to this person and explain why you cut them out of the picture. See, I told you the damn past. I, I told you you're dealing with the past and the past, but not the present past. Even though you're in the present past, you're going to the past past. Even if the present past became before the past. <laughs> I know some of you followed that. Tell me about this page of pence. And this page of pence is going to come in and offer something. And they're good. right now, they're, they're coming out of feeling entrapped. All right? Dealing with the emperor. This person you're dealing with is out of control right now. Because they're still dealing with all this BS, guys. But yet, they still want to come in and apologize. And it's like, okay, why why come in and apologize if you're going to come in and you're not even in the right mind frame? Super foolish. Super foolish. Or you're going to come in and break down the fact that, unless you were dealing with an Aries, you cut an Aries out, but I guess it would make sense that this element was dealing with air or fire. Tell me about the Emperor Reverse. To me, it's just like, it's just six of cups. So the, the, it was between air and fire. But we got earth here too. I don't see water. All right. Um, because the empress could be Taurus. So we're still dealing with earth. I don't see water on the board. All right. So except for the apology. All right. They may have water in their chat, but chances are they have all the other elements in their chat that are sticking out even stronger right now. This, this group right here is going towards a twin. And they just broke up with their recent scenario. And it ended up being a third party scenario. You know how I feel about going from one relationship to another. But when this is the way, when this is divine. So I'm not voicing my opinion when it comes to that. Because we all have our own opinion when it comes to that. I just don't like the whole jumping thing. But there's a reason for this, alright. So you're going to go in and apologize and understand why. You cut somebody off and you've been carrying a lot, a lot of weight and you need to go and apologize because you feel like you're going to crack. Um, it is going to release anger and, and, and overthinking and it's going to release a lot of things when you, when you do this. Okay. Um, And there's definitely another person involved. So this is what's brewing. For those that are waiting on somebody, they were with somebody else. It was kind of like a another scenario I read the other day. All right, this is what's going on. Um, I'm going to pull lessons individually for my elements. So let's do lessons for... Oh, I had a card in there. I know I had one of these cards in there. There it is. I want to know what it's sitting on. Denial. Somebody's in denial. Somebody doesn't want to take a new stop because they're in denial. All right. Somebody's fearing this new stop. And in my other spread, it was air that was fearing a new stop. It was Fred. 
whether it was air or not. It was just that person coming in with that message. But, all right. Let's go on my Cappy's advice. My Cappy's. Trust. Trust the scenario. Whatever this is coming back around, trust your inner voice. Use your intuition. All right. It is love. Okay. Um, this person coming to you or you, it's all about self-esteem. Okay. And having the confidence to to come and approach you and apologize, all right? So that's the best advice I can give my cappies is, is trust the scenario, okay? It is it is destined, trust the scenario, all right? Secrets still need to be revealed, though, I'll tell you that. Um, I'm not taking that. It was relationships, though, but what's going on with my Tauruses? Lessons, advice from my Tauruses on my lessons. Change, all right? I understand that nothing can grow and involve without movement. So... There's this change coming, all right. Well, yeah, I would I would hope so. <laughs> all right. Um, patience, this is divine. Everything happens in divine order. All right, my little Tibetans. Um God, this is both I well, I I already called the twin and, and destined, all right. So for the two of you, this is for those two of those elements right now, it's just destined. It was it's the way it was supposed to go down. All right, what's going on with my Virgos? Any lessons? What's going on with my Virgos? growth same thing all right yeah there has been growth if you're questioning it find your balance all right you're dealing with somebody who envy and um envy yeah come on please envy and um greed uh are stopping this person too um and you also need to understand it's it's kind of this it's kind of the same thing this person is growth everybody goes through their own challenges they're asking you to you know balance out certain things don't judge don't judge. I know you want to sit there, Kai Kai, but like, I, I don't, I, I can't, I can't deal with it right now. All right. I'm sorry. Sit on mama's lap. All right. So this is for all my elements, earth elements right now. Like this is very, very destined with this twin. This is, this is the way it's supposed to go down. Okay. Um, so there's that. I will tell you the person you were waiting on was dealing with someone else was in some type of commitment. The other person was in some kind of commitment. There was a third party there. All right. And that's why you were cut out of the picture, but there's still a lot of truths that needs to be told. All right. Don't you dare do that. You better think, Will. You better think before you do that. <gasps> lucky I love you um so now you have a decision to whether or not you're gonna accept this person's apology if you're questioning whether or not this person has growth has grown yes if you're questioning whether or not you can trust the scenario yes if you're questioning whether or not this person's really changed yada yada yes all right this person's pride really isn't getting in the way as much as it was before, so now it's time to balance out the scales. Okay, here comes judgment. It's just like my water. You guys must be dealing with water. But anywho, I love you guys. All right. Have a fabulous week.